you guys, it's Saturday night and I went to bed and I got back up because I'm too alive to sleep. <laughs> so I got back from work and before I went to work I was watching, I was in a really seasonal mood so I tried to watch all the five awesome girls from about mid-December till New Year which was a lot of fun. And then when I got back I continued what doing that. I got really excited and of course I got really inspired to make a movie. So this is what I need to do because I've made like a couple recently and they've never gone up. So I just think I need to keep doing that. So yeah, that was alright, yeah. So a quick catch of what has happened recently. Well, I got a boyfriend called Mike. He's really sweet and I <laughs> hate saying that. Yeah, my boyfriend, Mike, and I went to London on Monday with my friends and my sister. And I didn't take any photos or do any videos because we basically just stayed together for the day. Me and Mike basically. <laughs> just like holding hands walking around London so it was like... It wasn't that exciting to be honest. But it was exciting, it was nice. It was nice. Yeah, it was nice. But there was nothing to like take photos of. <laughs> we were just like in the moment, which is really awesome. But then we both got ill, Mike's really ill still. So I won't see him probably until I go back to school. It was just horrible because that was Tuesday and I really want to see him actually Monday. I'll call him tomorrow anyway. <laughs> so yeah. And on Thursday something really awesome happened. My sister and I went to um, Gosh Cathedral because they were showing Harry Potter and Half the Prince again. It's a lot of fun, we dressed up. I do have photos of that, so I will post those up with a video. Possibly. <laughs> yeah, I dressed up inspired by Cho Chang. I wasn't actually Cho Chang, but I dressed up inspired by her look from Order of the Phoenix. And I even like printed a hoodie to put like a ring called Quidditch hoodie on on the back it says Chang in 7 it was really cool and then Heart FM the local radio station took off a photo and that's up on the website so if you go to heart.com <laughs> you can find it it's great um one second I've had a drink since we got the back yep I have not GCSEs next month. That is terrifying. You have to get a B or above or you can't take the higher papers, which is the ones that you do to get an employable job. So I'm very nervous because I have absolutely no motivation at the moment to revise. I've got my stuff out and I'll just like put it away again. I feel so strange at homework. I have a ton of homework and coursework that I really need to finish. And I'm just like not in at the moment it's horrible I think I've only done my maths and that's it and I have so much to do and I, I'm just going to have to do it all tomorrow and I even nearly did my French now today is Halloween but my mum won't let us believe in all that stuff so yeah it kind of sucks I want to be out you know having fun possibly watching the trick or treaters because that is quite funny it's like watching them beg it's ridiculous but she has succumbed into letting us have a jack-o'-lantern so this is our jack-o'-lantern that is my jack-o'-lantern jack-o'-lantern I scooped it out mum decorated it because she's mean and let me do it she's mean she was ill and I I was bored all week and I was ill and horrible so she still won't let me do it. Do I have a name for the Jack Lantern? Something like Bob or something. Just call it Elmo. Elmo the Jack Lantern. Any anyway, rest of you guys, I will see you back at school on Tuesday because let's face it, our lives aren't that interesting, it will see each other before.
Thank you.